Hey Shadows, how's it going? Shadow Sick here. Welcome to Oxen Free, the games with gold. I know it's a little bit late, I apologize. But shit's been fucking busy, man. This is my only day off. Anyway, let's just get fucking raw into it. Never heard of this game, never seen any of it, but I do know there's a lot of cool uh, walking dead actors in it. Ooh, vibration. Let's let's play. Oh wait, should have added. It used to be a military base. Fuck. Well, it... Oh the Totally forgot. That's the one thing I should have added. Used to be a ranching thing, then it was turned into an army thing, then it became a. Wait a minute. Why are the subtitles active? Fuck it. Oh, well, who cares? I'm not Bird putting thing, it in the story anyway. Whatever. Henry Fonda stationed here, yeah, I think, for a bit. Unless he was Navy. Who's Henry Fonda? Around Christmas time, this little Whoa. breakfast place used to sell these amazing polar bear sugar cookies. Man, those were good. And then one year they changed the formula or whatever and ruined it. Lol. Alex? Hey, still with us? You haven't said anything for like ten um. minutes. Yeah, yeah, my my mind drifted for a second. So you all moved in? Um not not really. I just got in this morning. And how did her mom meet your dad exactly? <laughs> they met on vacation in Orlando. He got lost in a... You know, actually, I'm not even going to tell this story. It's really not worth it. <laughs> okay. Uh, yes, please don't. Let's not relive their meat cute any more than we have to. And you guys just met tonight? Yeah, I was, um... I'd been out of school, and the timing had just never worked out, so... And what? Does that make you to her, then? Hey, uh, second cousin? I don't know how people math works. He's my stepbrother. Oh, yeah. I forgot that was even a thing. Well, at least you seem cool, right? Cool guy, cool hat. You get a cool new sibling living right in your house. Sharing your toothbrush. Wearing your clothes. Eating your food. No, that's the weird part. I mean, isn't it like... The concept of just getting a new sister like a puppy, isn't it kind of awkward? <laughs> no, it's been no. totally bizarre. But just for the record, I don't consider you a pet. So I'm gonna play. So I'm playing a chicken. How do you two know each other? Ren is a oh, bitch. Oh, way back when, like he sounds old, really annoying. Grade school era. Young enough that I've seen her in a bathtub, and it wasn't sexual at all. I mean, what the fuck? Cradle <laughs> blocks. <laughs> Why are you even talking about this? <laughs> it's humorous, right? It's just interesting. What I the think shit. it's interesting. Look, I'll leave this in and probably Check play for about like 10, 20 sure minutes. Leave behind any grandchildren. Uh, wait, who's talking right now? It's a recording. They always play. Oh, oh, we should get a quick picture. All of us. This will be like the before shot. They're <sighs> Fine, just hold the camera out. Like, far. I don't look my freshest right now. It's true, Jonas. This is like B-minus Alex. Just for your uh, calibration. What the fuck? And it's Jonas? Not Jonah? Yeah, Jonas. Like Jonas Salk? Right, patient zero, AIDS guy. It's, um, biblical, right? Or is that the lion guy? I think every name's biblical, so probably. Here's good. Oh, I can actually move. Come on, Alex, join the fun. Sure. There, great. I'll magic erase all the warts out and stuff, so don't worry. Hello. Hey, Alex, you brought the radio, right? The little portable one? Yeah, of course. Perfect. Can you pull it out a second? There's the little guy. Our high school has a radio station, and Carly, she's a friend of ours. She's filling in because Reggie got mile from some track runner or something. It doesn't matter. What matters is that she's going to say something like, basically, right now, about our thing. So tune it to 88.3 so I can tell her we heard it. Oh, actually, it's a little after 10 o'clock, which means my dear friend Ren and his buddies are probably just touching down on Edwards Island for the yearly bash on the beach or whatever we call it now. But anyways, I promised him that I'd play a song from his band. So hope you're listening, Ren. Here are the red-headed bedwetters with baby carrots. <laughs> That's awesome. I hope Christina, with her talent show judge face, was listening. This is fucking we weird, dude. Close. There's no radio reception on the island. I'm glad I got to hear it before it went totally kaput. 
If we can't use it, why'd you bring it? Not just for the boat. Um, no. You'll see. I don't expect too much, but nah, it'll be fun. I won't undercook it. You'll see. She was literally just me right now, like... What? Lol. The art style's interesting. Wouldn't you agree? Ollie, 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 oxen free. Smell that clean air, boys and girls. Boy and girl. This ain't city living. Yeah, um, anybody need a smoke? I have a full pack. Uh, oh, uh, no thanks. I mean, I literally just said the clean air thing, so... Alex, you can bum one off me if you're empty. Uh... I forget if you're a fellow addict. Oh, uh, no thanks. I don't smoke. Last time I had one, it didn't go well. Yeah, no, I didn't know what coughing with your whole body meant until I saw you dry heaving. <laughs> okay, just checking. Alright, my other friend should be up and around the bend. Actually, that... I mean, I don't mean to be the guy to break us up already, but Ren, can you do me a favor? Can I have like two real quick minutes with Alex for a second? And you can, you know, you can run up and meet your friends. Uh, really? Just... Wait, is, is something wrong? What is it? Nothing's wrong, nothing's wrong. It'll just take two minutes, super fast. Weird. All right, bud. <laughs> uh, look, I, I don't want to go up by myself. I mean, can't we just stick together? You're going to have all night to say, like, whatever. But since you want to meet up with your friends anyway... We're all going to meet up with them. No, it's... it's fine, Ren. Go on up ahead and we'll catch up with you. Um, okay. I guess. Though this is a really strange way to start off, splitting up. It'll be fast. Thanks, man. I'll just be up the hill, in case... whatever. Lol. Ren seems nice. Awkward shit. He's funny, you know? Reminds me of a guy I know back home. He annoys me. I don't know. He sometimes gets on my nerves. Listen, I just wanted to grab you ahead of time and say you've been cool about everything. And I guess it's just for me, I, I, I've never moved anywhere. And like getting a new family at the same time kind of feels like I'm skipping the training wheels. And not that it's been bad or anything. You and your mom have been great. Uh, we'll make do. Lemons, lemonade, however that goes. An optimist. Oh, Christ. Oh, stop it. Oh, and thanks for setting up the attic for me. It's cool how it's like a little bedroom. I was in the basement at my old house, so... Yeah, no problem. Anytime. I have no idea what they're on about. I heard your mom's dead! It's nice at night, isn't it? <laughs> yeah. We can catch back up with Ren now. I didn't mean to take so long. Alright. Can I run? Wait a minute. It's kind of kitschy. Right? It's kind of kitschy? Yeah, it's like a quiche. The music's nice, but I feel like I'm... Flying, we are... Funning. Um, I think it's supposed to say running. Oh. Lock us off at night since nobody needs to use it, or maybe they just had a parade. Sure, either one. Creepy shit, I feel. So I'm finally getting to actually play the game. Uh, if nobody lives here and the stores are all closed, whose car is this? Oh, there's always that one lonely car in every parking lot. Hello, what? Something's not right, her. Ah. <sighs> God, this was even here. It's a monument to some submarine that was sunk off the coast. Oh, do the the um, the radio guide thing they talked about on the boat, you know? It's what, like 102.3? I just want to see how it works. What? Named after the Hawaiian god of the sea, the USS Kanaloa was launched on January 15, 1941 and commissioned into service at the end of that year under the command of Lieutenant James Earl Clapman. On October 28, 1943, it was sunk by the Japanese sub-chaser Tokusada, some 25 miles off the coast of Washington, and remains, to this day, the only submarine casualty in American waters. 85 officers, as well as 12 Army passengers, were lost. 
The propeller was recovered in 1962 and in 1965 erected as a monument to the heroism of the brave men and women who tragically perished. Named after the Hawaiian god of the sea, the USS Kanaloa was launched on June. All right. Parkson Facilities Office. Friend's sister Allison used to work there. You'd like her. She's tall. Um, alright. Lol. What? Are they gonna fuck you even other brother and sister? Up early. I guess no point in staying open if nobody's here. Hello, kids. Whoops. Look, the other guys and gals must be further up, so be quick now. Okay, speed read definition of Edwards Island. This is a tourist trap with shops and a beach. Nobody lives here except for some geriatric named Mrs. Adler. But, as God is my witness, we'll never mention her or any other old person's name again. We are here to drink and be stupid, a tradition apparently started by bored recruits in the 1950s who would sneak dates over from the coastal towns. They literally called it trawling. Uh-huh. Wow, that's actually kind of funny. Yeah, it's like kids at camp or whatever. So, the beaten path officially ends here. The beach is past the fence. I think Jerry told Oh look, it's a fucking map. Look at these bitches up there we gotta meet. Told me that there's a way that you used to get over there, but I'm blanking on what it was. But it's not, I mean, it can't be too difficult. Ugh, perfect. Well, just wait a minute and let me think. I think the dumpster will get us over if it'll budge. Well, let's try it. So, to summarize, we are not allowed here after dark. The town is shut down. And we, the Kamina High Junior Class, have come to commit improper acts. And the other thing is the Weirdo Caves. Weirdo Caves? The whole reason Alex brought her radio is because when you go to the... It's like the front. The mouth. The mouth of this particular cave, you can sometimes pick up frequencies to stations that don't exist. No, sure. Your voices or just sounds. And they're impossible. No, there must be some kind of logical explanation. Like... Like the rocks are somehow able to conduct lower frequencies or pick up broadcasts from further away or something. Or it's aliens. Aliens. So back up a second. Who's Mrs. Abner? Her family, I think, like owns or owns some of the island or something. She's been shacked in the same spot for like 70 years. She's kind of what you call the local legend. She has a house on the other side of the woods. <laughs> I think that's what I would call a hermit. Well, it takes a certain someone and actually, you know what? Speaking of the opposite of those certain someones, drum roll please. Jonas, did you know that a little birdie told me that our Alex here is thinking of going out of state to college? What the fuck? Oh, really? Yeah, so... And did this little birdie tell everyone he did Susie Lyons even though it was only over the pants stuff? Uh... Oh! Just because Mark spends his study hall at the advisory board doesn't mean he's allowed to look through our submissions. Look, Alex, I just... If you are thinking of leaving, I just hope you're doing it for the right reasons. That's all. That's my whole spiel. What the hell does that mean? Nothing, nothing, Ooh. nothing at all. Do what you want, forget I said anything. Thanks so much for bringing me out, you guys. Totally I missed tell it. I'm going to have a really good time. Oh, shut up. What else would you be doing? Good point. <laughs> Alright, let's go to the cliffs then. I have no idea what I was meant to say. But it's very quick. But I'm still very tired because this game is kind of boring. But I mean... The whole, like, different choices things is pretty fun. Still seems very linear, though. So I haven't been talking much. One, I'm tired, and two, it's just, like, more... This game's oh, just all um, dialogue. Before we get there, I should... I should probably mention that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. Who's that? That's... So, there's this girl. Nona. She's just this girl, and I'm totally into her. And I want her to be into me, so just, you know, j just be cool, okay? No pouting or complaining or anything, all right? Deal? Ren. Relax. Oh, and okay, Jonas, now that we're dumpster buddy. <gasps> what? What's going on? Should I? Some birds flew out of a hole and scared me, that's all. <laughs> birds. Cheep, cheep, cheep. You big goof. Oh, so they're down there. Hey, is this like a part of the base? This far out on the beach? I honestly don't know what that is. 
But remember, you can pull out your little radio and tune to that tour station if you want. This data command annex, as it had been dubbed, was used during the base's early years as the communication nerve center for outside military installations. It was also the primary office of Marianne Bozek, a civilian who developed communications protection through the invention of the famed wall system. A type of radio frequency identification, wall, standing for wave-assisted lock, assigned each person who was stationed at Fort Milner a call sign through which they could use their portable two-wave radios to unlock prescribed doors and gates. Though the mechanics are considered outmoded today, the island still uses this security method to honor its rich history. I guess we're gonna go get those bitches downstairs. Reginald, I hear you over there. Hey, guys. Wait, I was saying... I was about to tell a story, what was it? About Brad's car? Oh, well, that can wait. No, what? Hey, we started a fire down the way, but Nona wanted to play beach nanny, so... Uh, yeah. Everyone, this is Jonas. Jonas? Everyone. Hey. Hi. And Jonas, that's... Who are you again? Jonas. Jonas. He's Alex's new in town, fresh as the daisy stepbrother. Stepbrother? Really? Yeah, I know. It's a trip, right? Uh... Yeah, you think he'd be a little old to need a babysitter, but here we are. <laughs> yeah, if I don't have anyone to burp me, it becomes a real issue. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. You're Jonas. Jonas, the stepbrother. Yeah. Um, what's your name again? That is Clarissa. How but are she's... your stepbrother? Like, what does that even mean? Um... My mom married his dad, so family, law, and all. Yeah, well, I guess this is happening now. This is a thing that is happening, so... <sighs> Where's everyone else? Nicole had that tennis thing. And? Uh, who else was supposed to come? Anyone? Everyone? Clarissa, we... <laughs> we took the last ferry. I thought more would show up, but... <laughs> oh my god, it's just Alex and her new stepbrother? <laughs> That's it. That's who you brought. That's the group. Wait, aren't you all, like, friends? I'm friends with Nona, and I'm downgrading Ren to, like, a creepy neighbor. And you, I just met. <laughs> yeah, no, I don't say anything. I'm getting the picture now. You see, Jonas, normally this is like a 20 deep rager, but Pat had a party last weekend, and... And a bunch of kids got caught TPing the school. But this is great, right? We're on Edwards Island. Forget those losers who couldn't handle the weekend, who didn't think we could make it, who lost my invitation, who had to go Faster. on there. We've been hearing about this for years, and now we're gonna do it. This is gonna be amazing, right? Right, guys? I'm not gonna say anything. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's go. Fuck this guy. Fuck these bitches. Yeah! He's so annoying. Like, I couldn't get less of that bitch wanted to fucking... Doesn't want to be friends with me. I don't want to give a shit. It's whatever. These load times, though. Kind of sucks, man. It's just them. Fire! Man's great equalizer. So, what's the, um... What's the, like, thing to do here? Other than, obviously, go skinny dipping and get murdered by Jason Kruger. Yeah, let's just get drunk. It's supposed to be a party, right? Hey, where does that old woman live? Oh, you mean Maggie Adler? Yeah. Nowhere. She's dead. What? Yep, killed over three days ago. It was all over the news. Local news, anyway. Oldest living resident. Oh, that's sort of a bummer. Yeah, well, we all gotta go sometime. In her case, later than sooner. And to answer your previous question, Jonas, the thing to do is lay on the beach and drink till you can't remember where you are. And sometimes play truth or slap. Yeah, let's play that. We can inaugurate Jonas. Ease him into the night's festivities. Isn't it a truth or dare? This is better than truth or dare because nobody ends up licking somebody's butthole. You what the fuck? Question, <laughs> you have to tell the truth, but if somebody can prove that you lied, the accuser gets to slap you. It's a good But stroking uh, the butthole would be better. Getting to know somebody game. Unless you lie a lot. I haven't played this since I was like 10. Can we do something else? Come on. It's a good way to start out the night. One round? It'll help everybody relax. The booze will do that, too. Fine. Let's all smack the taste out of our mouths, I guess. Hooray! Okay. So, first, we're gonna... I'll start. Ren. Uh-huh. Come on, fess up. You want to go out with Nona, right? Clarissa! Wait, wait, wait. I want to hear his answer. Oh, man. You're good at this. Well, if being good means being kind of mean about it... 
Look, it's tough to gauge. Uh, something mm -hmm. like... Enough stalling. I know you want to sample the goods. Now no. just say something. Oh my god. I, I, I like her as a friend, right? That's... I just like her as a friend. That's... That's all. She's cool. She's... She's just a friend. Oh yeah, right. Okay. Thank you, Clarissa. This was very enjoyable. No. We all know he's lying. We just can't prove it. <laughs> I'm not lying. <laughs> Whatever, man. Okay, it's Ren's turn, right? He gets to ask somebody something. Alex, Alex, Alex! <laughs> uh oh. Okay. I just have to think about which nerve I want to so delicately pinch. Oh, please. Shoot, I can take it. Okay. Mary, screw, kill. Me, Nona, and Clarissa. Why? <laughs> it's funny. It's funny. I don't know. And Jonas is family. Uh, I'd marry so Nona. Excluded. Well, I'd marry Nona. I like the quiet types. I'm flattered, I think. <laughs> okay, you're going down the line. Clarissa, obviously. <laughs> obviously. You're not going to call her out on that? No, I believe her. I mean, look at me. And wait. Wait, that means you kill me? Out of everyone here. Your best friend. Hey, you wanted to know. And I'm the only guy. This is Miss Andrea. Miss Andrea. I <laughs> okay, settle down. So, Alex's turn? This is awkward. Yep. Lady's choice. Alex gets to pick who to ask something of. Oh, great. Here we go. What's your favorite uh, Let's go fucking Professor Clarissa. Clarissa. Oh, boy. Yes, Mum? This is pretty fun just watching, I'll admit. Well, wait. If someone were to ask you to describe me, what would you say? Wow. Really swinging for the fences here. I'd tell them you were an average girl with common thoughts. Jeez. Why don't you say what you really think? Actually... Well, I don't know what I was expecting, so... Okay? Clarissa's turn now. Alex, you got a new brother. Pretty exciting. I'm sure Jonas is excited, or maybe... Excited isn't the right word. Maybe a little overwhelmed with just everything. Gosh, you know? what a bitch! Sure. It's a lot to take in and adjust to. I'm. Um... Is there like a question coming or what? I'm just saying what Jonas is already thinking. That statistics show if you get divorced once, you're probably gonna get divorced again. And the fact is, your mom divorced your dad. So let's put his mind at ease and hear why. I I don't I don't really need. Okay, just get to whatever point this is getting to. The point is, why did your parents get a divorce? Just so Jonas can hear it from you. Clarissa, I don't really care Ooh. why they got a divorce. Just you know why. Michael died and it broke everything and they couldn't handle it. The end. Well, now you know, Jonas. Don't die and everything will wow. be fine. Wow. Okay, Clarissa. You what? You know, guys, honestly, I think I'm pretty much ready to do anything else besides this game. Wait, let's... Let's not stop like this. We should like... Game's over, Ren. I won. And to celebrate, I'm gonna sit on the beach and drink, and maybe, if I'm feeling spicy, even take a nap. Maybe we could... And that's exactly what Nona's gonna do, too. Man, what is your problem, Clarissa? Just what did we... What did I do to make you act like I ate the last piece of chocolate cake on your flippin' birthday? Nothing, Alex. You did absolutely nothing. Cheese! If you guys in your scavenger hunt or playing Ring Around the Rosie happen to find anything more interesting than a slowly dying starfish, you be sure to just let me know. Super. <sighs> Whatever. What a bitch. Well, I want to inaugurate this bitch by checking out the caves. <laughs> uh, I mean, I would. I'm very but... clingy, Ren. <sighs> Fine. Jonas, you're a strapping young lad. Help boost me over the fence. The cave's just, uh, yonder. And I guess you expect me to just jump over after? But like I said, you're a strapping young lad. Okay, come on. Where are you from again? It's a small town near North Valley. Oh yeah, is it nice? If you like bars on the windows. Alrighty. Alex, you wanna check out the caves or? Sure. Yeah, let's do it. Boost me up? Yeah, come on. I will, because fuck those bitches. Anyway, oh, that's it for me. I've been going on for long enough. Please do like, share, and enjoy, subscribe, and it'll be a lot. See you in the next episode, whatever I make. Stars, I'm going to love you all, bye. Uh, oh, yeah, fuck, we got to rate this game. Oh, shit. Okay. Great story and trippy. Okay. Phenomenal game, story, phenomenal story. Everything was just good. Definitely something to occupy me when I'm bored. Seems like something I play over and over again. Game affects the story. 
uh, I love the characters, I've grown to attach to them, honestly. Great game, few bugs, don't really affect the story. Okay. Ass. Ass as fuck. <laughs> That's fucking beautiful, dude. 4.8 stars. It's not bad. Alright, let's rate and review this bitch. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna give this a 3. Because I kind of like it, but I just don't think I'd get into it. But if you want more, give it 5 likes. It's cool, but it's not me. It's cool, but it's not me. Are you... Are you fucking for realsies? It got removed. Oh, you bitch. You fucking bitch. It's cool, but it's not for me. Because I'm not gonna lie, it's cool, but I just... I don't know, I just don't find myself that I'll be playing it a lot, you know? But, uh, that's that. That's Oxen Free. Yeah. Uh, please like, share, and subscribe. Help me a lot. See you in the next episode. Whatever I make. Stars, whatever. Love you, boy. And, uh, peace. Fucking 10 out of 10 dialogue and script writing. Come on, gotta get the first. Where's the next, guys? This is second place up ahead. What the fuck? She's a bitch.